Do you often find yourself slumping back in your chair or slouching forward staring at your monitor at work? If you do, then you must have experienced some sort of pain in your lower back, shoulders or even your neck. And even if you haven't so far, this is the right time for you to fix your posture by doing necessary stretches and making ergonomic changes to your workstation. Hey, this is Moving Umar here and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here and want to get healthy, fit and shredded, make sure you hit the subscribe button along with the bell icon so that you get notified every time I make an upload. Now on to the rest of the video. In this video, I'm going to be talking about five different body parts that are affected the most because of bad posture. I'm going to be giving a quick fix along with the long term solution for each and every one of these problems. So let's get started. Let's start with the most important part of your body that is your lower back. It is a fact that lower back pain is one of the most common work related problems excluding your boss of course. So let's understand what's going on back there. Slumping and slouching changes the alignment of the spine which is naturally in the shape of the letter S. But when you have a bad posture, the alignment goes for a whack which results in strain in your muscles and ligaments around your back. Here's a quick fix. Whenever you experience any strain or pain in your lower back, rock your pelvis back and forth so that you loosen up the muscles in your lower back. A more long term solution would be to support your spine with a lumbar pillow or just roll up a towel and place it behind your back. That way you can maintain the natural curve of your spine and stay safe. You should also keep your feet flat on the floor and make sure that your thighs are parallel to the floor. The second one would be your neck and shoulders. By keeping the monitor and keyboard at the wrong place, for example keeping it too far away from you can severely affect your muscles and soft tissues that are present in your neck and shoulders. A quick fix to this would be to perform the chin tuck exercise. For this one, you're going to push your chin forward as much as possible and then push it back in the opposite direction, holding it for two to four seconds and repeating it about four times. Another stretch that can help you out is by tilting your head so that your right ear goes closer to your right shoulder letting your left hand hang loose to feel a really good stretch. You're gonna hold this for 30 seconds and do it two times on each side. A more long term solution for this would be to keep the monitor right in front of you and if you frequently use the phone, I would recommend buying a headset or a pair of earphones. Also, resting your arms on your armrest or on the top of a table at a 90 degree angle will help take some weight off your shoulders. The third body part which is often neglected is your wrist. If you find yourself with constant nagging wrist pain, then try this quick fix. You're gonna keep your hands together making sure that the palm is in contact with each other and then push your hand down and you're gonna hold this for 10 seconds. You could also try different stretches by holding your hand like this and pulling it towards you or you could also try these. Each one you're gonna hold for 10 seconds. Here is a long term fix. Whenever you're using your mouse or keyboard, hold your wrist naturally so they're floating horizontally in the air, not perched higher than your hand or resting down on your desk. The fourth and also a very common one is eye strain. There's often a lot of strain on your eyes either because of keeping the monitor too far away from you which makes it difficult to read smaller text or by keeping the monitor too close to your eyes which makes it difficult to focus. People also don't blink enough which makes their eyes really dry. A quick fix to this problem would be to blink rapidly and freak your colleagues out. Also, you can look at something else far away from your screen every 20 to 30 minutes so that you give your eyes a much deserved break. A more long term solution would be to keep the monitor one arm's distance away from your eyes and making sure that the top of the monitor is at the same level of your eyes. So the last and final one is having tight hips. We often don't realize how much we sit during the day. Let me paint a picture for you. The moment you wake up, you 
sit in the bathroom for 10 to 15 minutes, then you sit on a chair having breakfast for 15 20 minutes and you sit in your car for about an hour on the way to work of course assuming that there is traffic and then at work you sit for at least 7 to 8 hours now repeat that for 25 years till you retire this might lead to some stiffness in your hip flexor so here's a quick fix the first one is called the dragon pose you're gonna kneel down on the floor like you're about to propose to someone then shift your knee pushing your pelvis forward keeping the heel down you should feel the stretch in the upper thigh right here hold this position for a minute on both sides another good stretch is the frog pose split your knees as much as possible in this position letting your chest sink in you should feel the stretch in the groin and hold this for at least two minutes a more long-term fix would be to stand up from your desk every 20 to 30 minutes i would recommend keeping a reminder or you can get an app called stand up which basically reminds you to stand up every now and then it cannot get better than that so the common question of the day is which body part bothers you the most while you're working leave your answers down in the comment section below and i will try to help you guys all right guys that's my time thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up and make sure you share it with your friends and family who you think might benefit from this video i will see you again in the next video peace